I live in Millis and serve the Sikh community there, and I'm very much a part of the larger Sikh community in Massachusetts and throughout the country. My privilege tonight to say a few words to the congregation on behalf of the Sikh community. First of all, on behalf of everyone in the Sikh community, we want to thank the sponsors of this service, the Islamic Council of New England, the Jewish Community Relations Council of Greater Boston, the Massachusetts Council of Churches, and of course, Trinity Church. The love and support the efforts made here represent a deeply felt commitment to fellowship and an effort to understand the other. We deeply feel that support and very much appreciate these efforts. It's also appropriate, I think, for, for us to express gratitude to all of those individual friends, colleagues, public officials, and others who express their concern and sympathy with the Sikh community. I know I speak for many when I say the response we received as a community after the tragic events of August 5th was overwhelming. We are here tonight to also, in some tangible way, express our solidarity with those who were most personally and profoundly affected by the attack on the Abu Ghraib Gurdwara. For us, it's hard to imagine how it may feel to be attacked in the midst of an ordinary day, to come under fire while turning the key of a familiar door preparing a meal or practicing music and a song we love. These events help us to understand how easily peace in our communities can be shattered. And we stand in awe that after such an event, members of the Oak Creek community spoke of forgiveness, acceptance of the will of God, and pride and bravery that was demonstrated. We are inspired by the actions of those who valiantly defended their friends and families and by those public servants who rushed to protect this religious gathering. And we are devastated to see the loss of such innocent life. This service and these kinds of gatherings are the only reasonable response to such an attack. Our efforts to develop compassion and understanding are essential. It's clear that when one person can do so much harm, we all have become responsible to promote and preserve peace. The responses to these events that inspire us represent virtues we hope to find within ourselves. In every faith tradition, and among those who follow no particular spiritual path, there is an understanding that we yearn to express in our actions those human qualities and values that demonstrate the nobility and grace of our spirit and our highest and most sublime nature. Tonight, we gather to examine what form this longing takes in the Sikh tradition and to experience what in this tradition can renew our own belief in the value of love and compassion. We look for new ideas in this tradition that can extend our understanding and help us to determine whether there are elements in this approach that we share with everyone in every faith and in every tradition. The first words in City Guru Granth Sahib, the Guru of the Sikhs, is Ek Omkar. God is one and everywhere. God is around us everywhere. In the light of the eyes of the other, in nature's play, and in all that befalls us good and bad. When we realize this reality, according to the Sikh tradition, by the grace of God and Guru, we enter a state of charity kalah, boundless enthusiasm, undying joy. In that state, we become absolutely resilient and deathless. This evening, we will practice one of the three pillars of Sikh faith intended to infuse us with the spirit of charity Kala. We will remember God in song, with our own voices, with our own breath. We will sing the praise of the Creator. Tonight, we are the Holy Company. 
You will see in the program the hymns of the Sikh Gurus in the original Gurmukhi in transliteration to help us sound out the words and in translation. Tonight it is our privilege to sing together, to open our hearts, to share and to eat together so that we will feel truly satisfied. It is our privilege to announce the nobility and grace with which we are created. This is the goal of every seat. Tonight, we can all be six. Thank you.